Hey, what is going on guys? It's your boy from XBL here. And today I want to bring you guys is a 4 minute honey badger cam on the map free in the game mode of free 24-7. Now I really like this game mode, but there are a lot of tryhards in it. For example, I got three 20 plus streaks with the VKS, the sniper. And I got jump shotted by these kids with MTARs just through the wall. I got really pissed off because if I brought you guys a VKS chem strike sniper chem, you guys would have loved that. And you know, I'm still going for it, guys. I will still get that gameplay for you guys because I know I can. It's not that hard to get with the VKS sniper. That, that sniper is actually not that bad. Semi automatic. And I really like it. But today, what I want to talk about is a nuclear returning in advanced warfare. Now, all of you know that there was a nuclear in Black Ops 2, and it really wasn't, it didn't really do anything. It was just a metal, which is kind of boring. Um, and then in Ghost, they had the Chem Strike, and in MW3, they had the Moab. The Moab is awesome. I didn't really like the nuke because it ended the game, but the Moab was there, the invention, the. The thought of it, whoever thought of it, that he's a god. And I like the chem strike too. The, the chem strike and the mob is the same thing. Uh, I really like both of those ideas. They should put in advanced warfare, but I don't think they are. Because when you get onto a five kill streak in advanced warfare, you get a bloodthirsty metal. Now the picture will be up right now. And then when you get a ten kill streak, it's the what is it? It's uh, I don't know. The picture will be up right now. Then fifteen is ruthless, and then twenty is I'm pretty sure. I think it's like merciless, and then. Uh, I didn't get their picture of the 25, but then the 30 is the nuclear. The nuclear is up right now and will be up for the rest of the video. The nuclear. But I'm not sure if they're going to have something for 40, 50, 60, 70. But uh, it's just going to be a nuclear, guys. Nothing really popped up uh, in the in the trailer. But they may be saving like a MOA. Like if you get the nuclear, then you may call in a nuke. Which I hope does not end the game. Because if it does, that's going to suck. Because then you can't... Like if you get like a quad moab or quad chem you can call those in but if you got a quad nuke it's, you can't call them all in which kind of sucked in mw2 for all those pub stompers that went ham but i mean i i really want there to be a chem strike or a moab in that game i know you guys would want to see that too because then it would be cool you can actually call it in instead of a metal popping up i mean i know watching black ops 2 is fun but, I mean, watching Ghost and um, MW3, I, I think it's more enjoyable because you're calling something in and it's, you let the other teammates know or the enemies know that you're a boss and you just drop the chem or two or three or four on them. I really think that's cool. Um, I really want that to return in Vets Warfare. If you guys could please leave your thoughts in the description or in the comment section below, that would be great. And go subscribe to my clan channel, Sin. I just had my first uh, commentary upload on, on their channel. I'm a pub stomper and a commentator there. So uh, one of my gameplays will be up there in two three days. But I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay in the commentary. I'm going to leave you guys with some music, but uh, leave your opinions in the comment section below. I always love listening to you guys' opinions. Um, please do that. Please comment, please like, it really makes me know that you guys like what I'm producing, and you know, if you don't like what I'm producing, then tell me in the comment section below, or what you want to see, that always helps, but I'll see you guys in the next one, I'm out, peace.